Welcome, fellow gamers, to our latest video. We've put together a visual feast for you, showcasing the hottest must-have immersive mods that have recently hit the scene. In this video, you'll find a curated selection of some of the most exciting and talked about mods, giving you a quick and comprehensive overview of what's trending in the immersive gaming world. So get ready, because your enthusiasm has driven us to present a collection that's sure to exceed your expectations. Let's dive in. First on our list is the Remote Interactions mod. This remarkable addition transforms the way you engage with NPCs in Skyrim. With the Remote Interactions mod, you can now interact with both friendly and hostile NPCs from a distance, introducing diverse animations and outcomes that depend on the specific context and distance. Depending on the situation and the type of NPC, your interactions can lead to various results. You might engage in amusing conversations or share a laugh with friendly NPCs, while hostile NPCs might prompt you to fight or make a hasty retreat. But that's not all. During combat, you can provoke enemies, surrender to guards, threaten foes to flee, or even goad them into joining the fight. What's truly captivating is that you no longer need to approach NPCs closely to initiate interaction. Instead, you can call out to NPCs from afar. By enhancing the way you interact with NPCs, this mod elevates the immersion factor of your Skyrim experience, providing an entirely new level of engagement and connection with the game's world. Next up is the NPCs React to Invisibility mod. The NPCs React to Invisibility mod brings a whole new level of realism to Skyrim by adding various reactions when you turn invisible in front of people. Imagine suddenly disappearing before the eyes of an NPC. Their surprise and confusion will be palpable. These diverse reactions from NPCs will not only add an extra layer of fun to your Skyrim adventures, but also enhance the overall immersion of the game. Get ready to experience Skyrim in a whole new light with this mod. Moving on, let's talk about the Improved Camera mod. The Improved Camera mod brings a significant enhancement to your Skyrim experience. It's an SKSE plugin that introduces a first-person body, allowing you to see your character's body in first-person view. But that's not all. It goes a step further by enabling various animations that are typically limited to third-person view to also be experienced in first-person. It effectively bridges the gap between first- and third-person experiences, giving you a seamless and immersive gameplay. This mod also offers a user-friendly GUI that lets you customize camera settings, events, and field of view settings according to your preferences. Get ready to dive deeper into the world of Skyrim with the Improved Camera mod. Next up, let me introduce you to the Skyclimb mod. Skyclimb brings true climbing mechanics to Skyrim. Utilizing EVG Traversal's animations, this mod employs cutting-edge technology seen in modern games to allow you to climb virtually anything realistic. Climb is procedural and enables you to ascend edges from anywhere in the game world. Using it is straightforward. Approach any ledge within a reasonable vertical distance. A blue marker will appear on accessible edges. Simply use the jump button to start climbing and ascend with ease. With Skyclimb, the possibilities for exploration and traversing the world of Skyrim are boundless. Moving on, let me present to you the Immersive Death Cycle mod. Immersive Death Cycle brings a realistic mechanic to Skyrim where animal corpses decay over time, eventually leaving only bones behind. This mod offers a more lifelike experience of the life cycle of creatures in the world of Skyrim. After an animal dies, its corpse will start to decay after about four hours, appearing partially rotten or consumed. Over the course of 12 hours, only the bones will remain. Moreover, this mod supports necromancy. Resurrected animals use custom models that trigger the partially decayed or consumed appearance. With up to six different models for each animal, the decay process won't become monotonous, offering a diverse and immersive experience. Moving on, let's talk about the SMC Skyrim Motion Control mod. This particular mod is an SKSE plugin that introduces various ways to modify your character's movement within Skyrim. For instance, it allows you to tweak factors like player acceleration, stopping distance, jump boost, and descent acceleration. By using this SKSE plugin, you can infuse your Skyrim experience with more dynamic and realistic character movements. With this mod, you'll notice that player acceleration and movement speed gradually increase over time. When coming to a stop, your character's momentum will cause them to travel a bit further. Additionally, executing a jump will now provide you with a speed boost. It's worth noting that rotating your player character will result in a decrease in speed. 
One of the great features of this mod is its customizable INI file, which empowers you to fine-tune various settings. You have the freedom to adjust factors such as acceleration speed, rotation speed decrease, enabling or disabling the mod when your weapon is drawn, jump boost intensity, instant stopping, and maximum speed. This mod truly offers a new level of control and realism to your Skyrim gameplay. Moving forward, let's delve into the Dynamic Sprint mod. This mod introduces unique sprint animations for different weapon types within Skyrim. When initiating a sprint, you'll experience distinctive animations that propel you forward. Moreover, the sprint animations will dynamically change based on whether you're in combat or out of combat situations. Employing the framework of Open Animation Replacer, this mod enables you to activate or deactivate each animation within the game, adjust conditions, and modify behavior data without scripting. By utilizing tools like Behavior Data Injector and Dynamic Animation Casting, you can seamlessly apply these animations. With the Dynamic Sprint mod, you can now relish in a more dynamic and realistic sprint experience throughout the Skyrim universe. Embrace the diversity of animations and enhance the immersion of your gameplay. Moving on, let's delve into the realm of the Simple Hunting Overhaul mod. This immersive mod brings a touch of realism and excitement to your hunting experiences within Skyrim. When searching the carcasses of animals, players can now peel off their fur to obtain it. This process is accompanied by animations, sound effects, and passage of time. It even alters the appearance of the animal's body. Additionally, you have the ability to carry the animal corpses. You can toggle this feature on or off using the Shift key. Carrying a corpse triggers reactions from NPCs, and you can sell certain corpses to specific NPCs. The charm of this mod lies in its simplicity and lightweight nature. It elevates the hunting experience, making it more engaging and immersive. Without scripting, it won't affect your performance, and it boasts excellent compatibility. Classified as an ESL, it won't consume precious plug-in slots either. Moving forward, we have the Ultimate Animated Potion NG mod. This mod enhances your imbibing experience in Skyrim by introducing animations to potion consumption. What's more, it employs Nick Knox's updated animations and behaviors, allowing for head movement, directional changes, and even some mobility while consuming potions. All potion models are supported. This includes not only vanilla potions, but also those added by various mods. Notably, there's no double sound bug, ensuring that the potion drinking sound plays only once. The beauty of this mod lies in its lack of ESP requirements. No separate plugin is needed. Elevate your immersion by savoring the added animations while quaffing potions. With Ultimate Animated Potion NG, you're bound to enrich your Skyrim experience. Lastly, let me introduce today's outfit mod, El Ginungagap. While it might not directly relate to our theme, I make it a point to introduce one outfit with each video to keep things diverse. Ginungagap is a stunning and powerful armor based on Lionheart Studios' Ginungagap armor set. It exudes a feel reminiscent of Skyrim's grass textures, with an exquisite combination of chainmail and leather that truly captivates. Moreover, this outfit, resembling a bikini or suit, enhances your character's physique, making them stand out even more. The mask comes with custom sliders, allowing you to adjust it to your character's proportions. Additionally, the armor is flagged as ESL, which means it won't occupy a plug-in slot. You can obtain the armor by crafting it at a forge, using console commands, or employing item spawner mods. Thank you for joining me in this exploration of the latest must-have immersion mods that have been recently uploaded. If you enjoyed this video and found these mods intriguing, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on the latest Skyrim enhancements. Stay tuned for more exciting mod showcases, and until next time, happy modding!